Hey y'all, playing with fire here. Got myself this what seems to be perfect size camp pot for myself. It holds one liter. It's coffee pop style. It's got a bale on it, and that's a bonus. And it's also got standard folding handles. The top itself It has a removable handle, but it also can be a serving bowl or a fry pan, depending on what you want to do with it. But anyway, it's nice stainless steel. It's nice. It's got a couple of problems, though. It's got some really, really crappy spot welds. You can see this one is about to pop off here. So what I'm going to have to do is take it and try and tack weld it. I don't have a spot welder made up, so so but I do have a set of uh, MAP gas welders that I can try and silver solder this together with or braze it together with. I'm going to give that a try. Uh, and then I'll, while doing this one, I'll also do all the rest of these while I'm at it. These ones here actually look pretty good, but these ones here, I don't know why they couldn't get a little bit of a bend on them, and then they, they would have spot welded a whole lot better. But, uh, it's, like I say, it's a great size little pot. I mean, 500 mils for, for the meal, and then you got 500 mils for whatever else you're doing, a hot drink of some sort, or another wrap. Uh, portion of food I'll include the link below but like I say my only complaint is that the spot welds are so chitty but I'm gonna try and remedy that myself I was trained on that sort of stuff so I'm gonna try and see what I can do with it shouldn't be that hard famous last words anyway plan the fire like subscribe comment and share share Uh, modern technology. So, I took a couple minutes, and I went out and brazed it. I really should have silver soldered it, but I don't have any silver solder. But it uh, really gets a good grip on the, the pan here, or, or on the pot here. Doubt it'll be that tight if you go once you fill it with water, but uh, I'm gonna get myself some silver solder, and then I'll redo all the rest of the the, the spot welds. Oh yeah, one thing that that that's about this thing is the bale only goes one way. It's got a little catch here, so it only goes one way, and the rivets are put in such a way that if you go and blow out a rivet or tear a rivet off, you're going to be able to replace them no problem. Probably may end up doing that myself, just because I really don't like these rivets. So, ooh, yeah, and grind those off and put in nice, proper well. Uh, I could get myself some little stainless steel nuts and bolts and put them in there. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Anyway, peace out. Uh, like, comment, share, and subscribe.